Subuser administration allows you to add, edit, or delete users as needed. You can manage the access your users have to accounts, transfers, and wires. You can also assist your users with resetting their passcodes and updating their contact information. To add a new user from the Cache Management tab, select Administration. To the right of Subusers Administration, use the drop-down and click Add a new subuser. Complete the user info section with the new user's information. All required fields are indicated by an asterisk. Pinnacle uses the social security number to authenticate that user when they call for assistance with online banking. If you choose to use a number that is not the user's social security number, be sure to communicate that to the user. You can use access configuration if you want to limit the IP address from which a user can log in to online banking. For example, if you want users to only access online banking from the office and not from home. This is only an option and is not a required field. Under Access to Accounts, select the type of access you would like to give the user for each account listed. For a list of all access types, click on Help and choose About Basic Services. You can also use Help if you are unsure about any of the fields listed on this page. Clicking on the Help link will always provide support for the specific page you are on. Once you're done, click Submit to Save. To edit an existing user, use the drop-down menu to the right of the user's name and select the option you need to modify. Modify sub-user information allows you to update contact information, reset the passcode, update IP addresses, and temporarily disable or permanently delete an account. Keep in mind, when disabling an account, pending transactions will be processed. But when an account is deleted, pending transactions will be canceled. Modify access to accounts allows you to add, edit, or remove access to accounts. Modify commercial services allows you to set wire limits, wire access, and determine which accounts those wires can be sent from. Wire access level definitions can be found by clicking on Help from this page and selecting About Commercial Services Access Levels.